That hurt you more than it hurt me. Do us a favor and keep it quiet, Dalton. If they don't shoot me, I won't shoot them. How's that? Bagley, update. Let's just say I'm both impressed and annoyed by how sophisticated this anti-tamper security is. Still working. Bagley, tell me you're close. I'm through security. Now wading through terabytes of decoy code looking for the destination sequence. Fucking got me! Cryptocurrency. Crypto now seems like it's been around forever, but it's really quite a new invention. Were you an early adopter? I was one of the first that was in this market. That seemed to be a new way of financial transactions, a new way of money. It's something that we could completely reinvent and change some of the legacy financial systems around the world and really give power back to the people. Yeah, it was a real shift in the way that the world works. And let's recap the basics. So central to cryptocurrency is the distributed ledger technology, the tech that keeps track of all transactions. And what this means is you can have a decentralized system without having to trust any one party, like old-fashioned banks. One of the reasons why I got involved so early was that you could stay anonymous. Yeah, the features of cryptocurrency very much fit into that early mindset. It was all about finding an alternative to centralized systems. It was kind of a countercultural punk ethos. The whole point of the distributed ledger is you're not trusting any one person to keep track of who has what money or how they're spending it. It's all out there in the open for anyone to see, and yet you can remain secretive. But not everybody now wants to keep up this crypto legacy. They don't share this attitude anymore. We've seen institutions, businesses, even governments experimenting with crypto, which which doesn't really fit into its original radical counterculture mold. Yeah, it's kind of weird today to think of people not using cryptocurrency. It's so mainstream now. You know, I'm almost nostalgic for the feel of cash. Good old fashioned paper and coins. First they changed the paper notes to plastic notes and now it's just all digital. There's nothing to hold on to. It was great just to be able to have a little bit of money to carry around with. I think the turning point in the UK really came a few years ago when the crown dropped 10% over the John Dees win. Get to it straight away. Dead set. All right, so tell me. Dead set. Anything else I can do? Uh. any of your guaranteed to work solutions. Oh, Jesus. 
fucking hell, did I just wet myself? situation now. Control, I've lost the target. Right, close this fucker down. 